Macaroni and cheese is a traditionally American dish that consists of pasta and cheese sauce. The dish is very versatile. Also, as you can also add a number of other ingredients such as vegetables or meat. This can be both a main or side dish and can be served very hot or warm. Hello and welcome to Ronnie's Restaurants. If you are watching this video and intend to learn more delicious recipes, then consider subscribing for more. Also, if you would like to help promote my videos, then please follow me on Facebook for more tasty dishes. The ingredients we will need 2 tablespoons salt, half nutmeg, 2 tablespoons mustard, 6 to 8 butter chopped, 1 medium sized onion chopped. 4 tablespoons flour, 1 cup Gruyere cheese, which is 115 grams, 1 cup cheddar cheese, which is 115 grams, 1 cup mozzarella cheese, which is 115 grams, 1 liter of milk, which is 4 cups milk 500 grams of pasta 1 tablespoon black pepper Let's wait for 2 liters of water to get boiled Now we're gonna close our lid Let's open the lid Now we can see our water is bubbling So we can add our next ingredients one tablespoon salt and give a good mix to the water and then we can add our pasta Now we're gonna give a good mix to the pasta and leave it for 10 minutes to boil the pasta. After 5 minutes, now we can check our pasta. So we, now we can see our pasta is boiled. To make sure, can. for the remaining 5 minutes, let's mix. Let's drain them. Now let's add our remaining ingredients into the pot. First we're gonna add our butter. Wait for it to get boiled. Once butter is boiled, next we can add our onions. Now we can wait for to onion get brown color. Now we can see our onion is crispy brown. So next we're gonna add our Cups of flour, give a small mix. Let's add around half of the milk, give a small mix. Then add our remaining milk. Now we're gonna whisk 
the milk until the milk to get smoother for about five to seven minutes we're gonna whisk now we can see the milk is smoother and it look like heavy so which is which means the milk is ready let's add our remaining salt next let, let's add our black pepper after black pepper we're gonna add Now we're gonna turn off the gas and then let's add our mustard. Mustard give a nice color. And finally let's add our cheese. We're gonna keep a little bit of cheese. Next let's add our cheddar cheese. give a good mix now our cheese is melted so we can see the milk is heavy and smoother so now we can add our let's add our pasta and mix it's a good mix wow it's so yummy yum i'm so hungry can't wait it's so cheesy it's look delicious now our macaroni creamy pasta is ready to serve in a bowl let's put the macaroni in the container ready for baking let's add some additional cheese the reason i am adding lots of different cheese is because it is flavorful and crunchy now we are gonna put in the oven at 200 degrees for 20 minutes now we can see our uh, cheese is melting and it's gonna become a uh, crispier later on it's ready now now i'm gonna take out from the oven wow it looks irresistible thank you so much for watching today we made a macaroni and cheese dish that can be served hot and warm the cheese so nicely melts over the pasta and the crunchy feeling of taking a bit it's amazing before leaving 
if you want to see a particular dish next time then please drop a comment letting me know what it is once again thank you bye bye